cool. Yeah, it's uh, not the greatest in high wind, but it does look pretty, uh, or it does do the job in the indoors. Well, I, yeah, I would not set it on the floor for the new. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a, an accident waiting to happen. Look at these logs. Like, the water level must be so much lower in the, uh, at some yeah. point. Like, how yeah. old do you think these are? Ancient. My mom would still take me here for sure. Fishing. Oh, fish sure. Fishing here for sure. It looks pretty shallow here. It would be funny to put the uh, that thing on the uh, duct tape that onto the paddle. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. It's probably about, I don't know, three foot deep maybe. Let's try and hold it steady. And you can do cool stuff with it too. You can just throw it at the top. A nice, pretty versatile camera, so it's cool that you can you can go into like the uh, like flat regular footage and just basically crop and record if you want. It. Be a good rock to sunbathe on. Yeah. <laughs> Drag your mermaid tail. Yeah. Mermaid man. Mermaid man. It's a cool spot. It is. Here's another good toboggan spot over there. Down yonder. <laughs> Down yonder. So everybody who's watching this, I hope you're enjoying our mustaches. Stevens might be a little bit hard to see with his hat on, but you know, that's okay. We're still the two most stylish guys out on this lake. We're drinking a nice and cold beer, like all good canoers should. Oh, oh, cheers! Oh, <laughs> can't reach. <laughs> oh, we're gonna hit a log and we're gonna drown. Oh, ah, oh. oh, nothing like good that. Goodbye, gravity from Imperial City. Very good beer. What do I got? Bruce Trail Blonde Ale from Tobermory Brewing Company. Tobermory Brewing Company is great. We love those guys. And I'm always wrapping the Tober. Such a Tober man. <laughs> Tober man. It's all the moss and. So our tour guide today is Steve Bird. He is a lifelong resident of Pickerel River. He was actually born in this very spot. His uh, mom was swimming and birthed him right here. Uh, 42 years ago when he was uh, laid out of his bird egg. 100% accurate. <laughs> so if you look over to the right, you see some nice pine trees. Yep. That's actually the left. <laughs> <laughs> and if you look over to your other right, there's some more pine trees. Steven's ex <laughs> direction. <laughs> Uh, I wonder how that fly is going to appear on the camera. <laughs> hey, just floating there. <laughs> We're heading for the distant shores. So if you can believe it, we've been out here for about 37 hours right now. We just look so awesome that you'd never be able to tell. We're surviving on beer and white claws <laughs> and uh whatever the heck it's called cottage springs cottage springs and we'd like to show it to our sponsors today uh sacks sacks bathing suits sacks definitely sponsored us today under yep. armor active wear <laughs> sacks is keeping our sacks nice and cool and it's uh and comfortable <laughs> Cool and comfortable, and they're not liners. They're better than that. <laughs> mm. Oh.
not cross that. <laughs> Here we see these beautiful pine trees. What type of pines are we looking at, Stephen? That fly is back on the lens. Um, these are a variety of white pine. Can't tell if they are eastern white pines or. Western. Honestly, I don't know what other kind of white pine variety exists. <laughs> so, I don't know who made me the guide of this tour. Well, but whoever it was was an idiot. <laughs> I think your Tobermory beer made you the guide. I'm okay with that. Ah. Uh, what did you? Yeah. Ah, there's a fly on me. Oh, 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 gotcha. Oh, I didn't get you. Son of a bitch. Oh. So, we are good to. Oh, look at that, Stephen, over there. There's a big old. Yeah, yeah. Got a crane. Uh, heron. Heron. Blue heron. The blue heron. That'll put hair on your chest. Alright. Well, Should I start that's paddling all for again? today, folks. Tune in and whatever. Tune in next time. Next time. Blessings!